Oh, that's going on the sandwich. Oh, wow. Hey, hi, people. And I'm back. Willow Davis, how's it going? I feel like it's been a while since we uh, checked out some K's cooking on here. I mean, we've been watching on like the occasional live stream if you've been managing to catch those or the replays after. We do usually stumble upon a K's cooking video or two, but I saw she uploaded some new stuff recently and I thought it'd be cool to check out. And of course, as always, definitely go subscribe to K's cooking. I think she also uploads her videos onto her Facebook page. So there as well, if that's where you prefer <laughs> to consume content, I guess. Uh, not me, but maybe you. But anyway, as I said, uh, yeah, upload some, some new things we haven't checked out here yet. Round banana bread and egg salad sandwich and baked beans. But when I read that, I was like, I, they sound familiar to me. And I went and looked and yeah, a few years ago, she uh, had a banana bread recipe. And then uh, I looked up like a hard boiled eggs for the egg salad sandwich because it <laughs> The, the thumbnail for this video is quite interesting looking. Uh, and I, I looked for hard boiled eggs and I, I didn't find exactly that, but there's egg medoli, never heard of it. Uh, but I thought we could check out some of the older ones and then see the new ones and see if anything's changed in the way she uh, goes about making these things. What do you, what do you say? You down for that? 134,000 subscribers, very nice K. I, I know people write to K all the time with suggestions or requests for what to make, but but I want you to tell me if 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 you could see Kay's cooking make one thing, uh, what would it be? If it was just, you could pick anything, let me know in the comments. Anyway, let's check out this banana bread recipe from December twenty fourth, twenty seventeen, Christmas Eve. A little Christmas Eve banana bread, incredible. Hi, people. Oh and my I'm gosh, back what again. a start! And today I'm going to be doing banana bread. Banana bread. Let's go. As you can see, I've got a menagerie Let's of go. stuff. Is that a menagerie of stuff? So I'm going to put 10 ounces of flour. The ounces. I wonder uh, I wonder if for banana bread she's going to do the same thing where she like absolutely covers the table in flour and like just just keeps adding flour to it. That's my favorite when she's baking Eight. stuff. Nine. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. That banana is hardly ripe. Also, is it just one banana? Just a singular banana? I hope there's more, and hopefully they're a little more ripe. I'm seeing some green and on I'm the tip of that one. I like a nice soft banana for a banana bread. Into my new bowl I got for Christmas. Ooh, ooh, new bowl for Christmas. Very nice. And I'm going to put that aside. Can't get the lid off. The struggle, always a nice off-camera struggle. A spoon of that. Couple of couple of spoons of the non-measuring type. Love that. I think that might be too much. I'm sure, it's supposed to be a teaspoon. Well, I'm not all going to argue. It that says table. Oh my God! Doesn't look like a teaspoon. That looks like a regular like tables like then <laughs> regular spoon it says salt and I'm okay. a little seasoning don't get don't let it get too spicy teaspoon now salt. teaspoon the struggle there we go okay and then there we go in the separate bowl great, great job on the bowl that. I'm going to add Butter and sugar. Okay. Oh, you gotta, you gotta. How much butter? How much butter? Whatever. How much? Well, mix that in. Salt, butter. Don't like butter. When are we getting these First bananas the involved? Take the eggs out. Okay. There they are. Sugar and it. Oh God, I fucked up. Can't you get away with not using eggs in a banana bread because the banana will like hold it together or something? I don't know. One, oh my god, the off-camera struggle for several seconds. Ah, this is shit, yes, that's three. What'd you say? <laughs> oh, he's so overwhelmed. The butter. Couple of ounces of butter. One, two, three. The margarine's always so soft. I guess they keep it out, I don't know. 
three. Huh. Must see. be nice. Four. <laughs> so I'll tip that in with the sugar. Excellent job. <laughs> How long to mix the first three ingredients? Vanilla. Vanilla stuff yeah. I go through such a lot of this. Really? That's one. I'm tipping one in because it's well, one it teaspoon. Thick. And that to me is a Why teaspoon. Why is it thick? But it drips forever. So that's weird. Oh, I thought I think of vanilla extract as like very thin and loose. The same. Maybe it's like a syrup. I don't know. There we are. That quick. Interesting. You went really. Mix okay. Yes, the vanilla. How long to mix in the vanilla and the eggs? I'm not gonna I, this is a longer one. I think the other the other banana bread video is like three minutes that long. Round. Really honed the craft in the last couple of years, I guess. Right. <laughs> Make sure I've got all this. Just mixing this. Very good. Oh, we're beating that up, beating that up. I'm not gonna. Oh, hold on. I see the banana. I see the, the banana. banana up. I know it's only a little one. It's only a little one. Didn't know that small. What happened to the rest of the banana? You mashed the banana. You cut up. the tips off. Just one little tiny banana for it. Just one little guy. Not like three medium-sized bananas or something? Just the one banana? <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm up for the That's not, this isn't banana bread. This is friggin' bread with a little banana in it. <laughs> a pitiful amount of banana. Okay, beat that yes. up, beat that up. Ooh, that's thick. Ooh. Very nice. Looks good. I'm tipping some flour on this. Oh, here we go. Here we go. You can't just you can't just pour it into a pan and bake it. We have to roll it in flour. As if it's actual I'm bread. Is, you know. And I'm going to uh, take all this out of the... Uh... What is going on here? It's, it's, a, it's a pile. History lesson as well it's as a, a pile. cooking lesson. Oh my god, it's getting all crumbly. What's going well, on here? Okay. <laughs> That's it. I am not going to pat it down or anything because it'll spread it out in the spread it out. There's no such word as spread it out. Is I was like, you didn't even like pour banana bread into like a pan. <laughs> it will spread out in the tin. Like I said, okay. I'm only made of bread. Um, this is like this is like actual bread. Like I said, I'm only made of bread. Um, only making a small version of it. Oh, uh, small version. That's why one well, banana. I only made a small version of it. So uh, yes, I'm going to put it in the oven. It needs to go in. I know I normally put things on 200, but in the recipe it says a 180. So I'll yep. put the oven on 180. The, the reluctance <laughs> to uh, to just follow what the recipe says. Love it. And then I'm going to put it in the oven now. <laughs> All right, let's see. Right, Ooh. as you can see, it's done Ooh. now. Uh, well, that looks pretty good. I mean, it doesn't look anything like banana bread I know, but uh, pretty cool. Well, yeah, it's done, and that's it. Usually, I, I think a banana bread is much darker. Right. Maybe a couple of nuts in there, some like chocolate chips or something. That would be lovely. Quite a bit off for Lee to try, so. Oh, Lee's giving a taste good. test. Don't you love when Lee gives a taste test? That's why I love you doing the taste test. Oh, so I'm like your guinea pig then. Oh, yeah. So the guinea pig. Looks it pretty good. Know. Throw a little butter on that. Listen to some tunes in the background. Some copywritten tunes. Or copyrighted. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> There's bananas in it. <laughs> Not strong. It's like you know. There's there's like a half a banana in it. There's like half a banana in it. Kay, look at her face. So disturbed. I'm just like eating a warm banana. It's like eating so, a warm uh, banana. I can't call it eating a warm banana. Well, that's what it's like with me. You know, obviously you can taste the bread as well. Yeah. It's like bread and warm banana, which is obviously. <laughs> You know. Tastes like bread and warm banana. Of course it does. Which is more or less what it is. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, but, uh, but it's, oh. uh, yeah. it's not that bad. Tastes like banana bread. I don't know what you want me to say. Oh, 
Well, thumbs good. up but anyway. Very nice, very nice. All right, I've just tried a bit. And actually, it, apart from the sugar's not mixed in very well. It looks pretty but good. Apart from that, for the first attempt, I don't think it's bad. So, nice. Enjoy it. So, if you like what you see, very nice. Good job on that one. Something came out very nice. Banana bread is a cake. It's not supposed to be like bread dough. Yeah, yeah, that's that's what I was figuring. <laughs> it's true. It's true. This comment, the quote, this is going to need rolling out with, with some scared faces. Case Cooking replied, yes. All right, there you go. Let's see if over three years later, three and a half years later, uh, if, if the... Uh, it's been improved upon it all with round banana bread brand okay, new video and i'm back cooking again and today i'm going to be making a bowie banana shirt oh wow bread. wild what a change up right as you can How see interesting. All the ingredients it says i've got to cream oh my god so much more organized this time look at this look at the progress over the years incredible the butter and the sugar together Right. Uh, as, then add the flour. As you did but, last um, time. I'm going to put my bicarb and my salt. Why are the eggs floured? In first. <laughs> See that? <laughs> and then I'm going to put the marge into the sugar. Then I'm going to mix it to right. make it creamy. Right. Then I'm going to add. You got to cream it. The eggs, then the marge. The eggs uh, and the marge. Then the bit. Then the, the bananas, banana, bananas, and then the slowly bananas. add the flour. Okay, okay. Look, so she's As you can see, trying I'm to follow a recipe here. Mixed it all together. Oh wow! Oh, you just did it. You just went ahead and did it all without us. Incredible. Adding little bits of flour. Slowly as I'm going mixing around. in the flour. This is uh, this is a good if you're start. Why you good say, start. Oh, that's not how you make bread. But I have just followed the instructions. That's true. That's true. Uh, As we learned last time, it's not really a bread. You are supposed to be able to tip. Looks like there's a pretty good amount of banana in there as well. So here's hoping that this works out better. Mixture into a very, very heavily greased tin. Heavily greased. Which I have got. Okay. Right, Doesn't show combining any of the ingredients, but we'll just show just stirring. That looks okay. For a minute. Right, I've added the rest of the flour. It's very as sticky. You can see, Look at that, yeah. Well, now it's ready to go into the. Uh, I think it's mixed. Tin. I think you're. I think you don't want to over mix right, it there. I'm pour it in now, as it said. Is that a fork? What's going on here? <laughs> What is this utensil here? And hopefully it's, it's it going. A bit out, so I'll get it all, all mixed out. A very interesting choice of what to film in this one. Oh, oh, it's oh wow. Okay, it's done. That was quick. That was that was very fast. It's a bit longer than it should have, but yeah, it looks it's looking pretty burned on the sides there. But I mean, I guess if it wasn't done in the center or something, I don't know. I don't know what happened there. It's looks a little smoky, doesn't it? Uh, it's risen, and I want to do the taste test. It's probably fine in the middle there. Oh I yeah, oh, it's fine. It. Oh, it's not so bad. It's got. I feel like it, when 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 can you ever get banana bread done? It doesn't have a little. A little singe on the side. Taste test. I'm dreading it because I don't know what it's going to be like. That looks good. Throw a little butter on that. Maybe a little jelly or something. Who knows? You give it a toast tomorrow morning, huh? Well, the bananas is very overpowering, but it's banana bread, so... <laughs> very overpowering, the bananas. Oh, yeah, wow. Yeah, I think it's turned out all right. <laughs> Okay, very cool. No, no taste test from Lee because he probably would have just been just taste like bread and bananas. There's gonna be a link in the description <laughs> to my merchandise. <laughs> if you like what Oh man, did Lee lose his job as taste tester or was he promoted? Lee can't have taste test. Okay, well that's he actually can't have cheese, but it looks like everyone wants Lee back to do the taste test so he can say that it tastes like what it is. Wow, you know, it's it's nice to see a, an absolute success.
from uh, from K here. That 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 was like a solid banana bread right there. Nothing nothing like nothing really just like obviously wrong with it. it looks pretty good. Next, let's check out what this is. I have no idea, but I think it involves hard boiled eggs. So I'd like to see her make hard boiled eggs. This is from February 2017, and then we have a new one from like the past week where we're making an egg salad sandwich. And look at this. Look at this drip right here. Look at this swag. Look at the K's good cooking shirt. The hat must be. I would love. I would love to uh, just like go on a website and purchase the merch. <laughs> it would be lovely. Back cooking again. Today, a nice I'll easy transaction, me. maybe through and PayPal. Melody. As you can see, I've got a Me egg, an egg melody. Melody, egg uh, melody. See, okay, that's a... interesting because it says egg medoli on the uh, title. Two pans laid out. I'm Is it to... an egg medley? <laughs> Is it a medley? Maybe that's it. I'm pretty sure it says egg medoli, but I think she meant egg medley, but she said egg. <laughs> Melody. <laughs> so three conflicting sauce. things there. To make it, mm, a little grease in the mold. pan. It might be wise I if see. I switched it up. Which ring is, is it? Is this the this like um? <laughs> is this like the egg poaching cups? Are you supposed to butter them? <laughs> I, I didn't. I don't know. <clears throat> I don't know. I you butter the egg poaching cups. So switch it on. Switch it on. Oh, we got a cold pan alert. Cold pan. Classic cold pan. Switch it on full. Switch it on full. Oh my god, be careful. It's a poacher. A poacher. Proper poacher. That's and a I'll pan. I'll tell you where it come from later on in the video. But now, at this, at this stage, I'm going to put some water in this. As I'm one would to poach an egg. too much in. Are you sure you would be buttering the little cups? But then again, story of my life, isn't it? And I as you can know, see, I've heard of that. I've greased. Oh, wow. These little trays. Okay, maybe you do. Yeah. I thought it was going in the water. Why are you greasing them? It's because they're not supposed to stick, but now in my cooking, they will stick. Oh, okay. So I'm going to turn that ring on. Fair enough, fair enough. And. What's that? So I have a feeling this isn't going to go quite right. <laughs> Crack. Oh, so what's going on with that, that pan eggs. on the left? Are we it frying is. eggs too? Is it an egg medley? We're doing like poached, hard boiled, and fried? Parchments. Oh, the word parchments. Oh. Shut up, the lads running like away. <laughs> Swear, the egg smack, on you. smack in the heggy with the knife. Classic, so classic K. I can tell by the way you're breathing. Oh, do we stop breathing? Don't even oh. start off your view with pull the wool. No, dear. I don't, I don't care what our, half my viewers think about you. <clears throat> don't care what our viewers think about you, is that what she said? <laughs> okay. Three. You have good. A pretty, uh, pretty good job opening these eggs, Kay. I know she usually struggles a little bit, not breaking the yolk, but uh. And oh, you, you, I think I saw some shrapnel fall about. Four. But, As I said, it's a but that's three. whatever. <laughs> if it doesn't bother you, <laughs> then. <laughs> okay, the that poacher. Is that thing on? We got the the pans going. Right. Are you not supposed to wait till it's boiling? And this I don't is a proper know. poaching lid. <laughs> so, proper poaching so lid. Oh, proper. so we're giving it a nice steam. And this. Okay, like I, I see. Said, the patty, the patty, the fat is melting in it. The fat is melting. I might be wrong, but the only eggs I know to do are poached, fried, boiled, and scrambled. Okay. But I'm going to show how to do it. Oh, we're doing all four of those? Wow. My way. And K's way? Incredible. Into the pan. 
Nah. That is. Oh wow, hot pan. We got a hot pan for once. Too hot. But then again, that story of my life is it having a pan too hot. <laughs> So, we, and, you know, so the pan's always uh, just absolutely dead cold and then just way, way too hot. Just both of those things. I'm not very good at cracking it. Oh, you busted it. You busted I'm, it. I'm going to... That's, oh, no. So at the moment, that's... Oh, I can't speak today. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> That's poached eggs. Oh, classic. A fried eggs doing. Now I'm going to show you my This way. poor pan that clearly was at one point non-stick. Look at it now, just absolutely bald. I do scrambled eggs. I love it. Which I love do it. for Ziggy. Scrambled eggs for Ziggy. <laughs> I love it the dog. The dog. Ziggy likes the scrambled eggs. A little heggy breakfast. What's going on over there? I'm beating that up. And what I do is I beat these before I put them in the microwave. The I put them in the microwave oh. for two minutes on full power. That's how you scramble them in the microwave? Aye. As you can see the poacher, too much water in it. Then again, story of my life. Oh, too, too, much too much water in the poacher. What is it Could you leaking out? Put that. They can see all the melted butter in the eggs in the poacher. Put the egg in the microwave for two minutes, please. Some microwave scrambled eggs. They're very interesting. I don't know if I've ever heard of that I'm one. Trying. Keep, don't forget about these eggs in the pan here. Fried eggs. Are you gonna give them a flip, or are they? Oh, are they sunny side up? I don't need, I don't need eggs, eggs anymore, eggs. personally. Oh, I'm making you work today, Lee. You have to, you have to move those soon. They're, they're, yeah. they're getting there. They're getting there. Thank you, dear. You could spoon some oil over the top of them to cook oh, the. Uh, oh the, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I thought it was a non-stick pan. What happened? <laughs> I'm going to turn the egg over. Okay. For simple reason. I want egg yolks too. <laughs> and I just want to say thanks for everyone who wished me well wish who wished me well wishes. <laughs> I'm not hundred percent, but I'm picking up. Okay. Uh, you can see it's stuck, but then again, don't tell my egg stick. That makes it part and parcel of the life cooking. It's supposed to be a non stick pan. I don't understand yeah, why it's sticking. It would be trouble. It would have to. It's completely rubbed raw pan. That's it. That's that egg done. How about those poached eggies? Those, those little the eggies. Doing now. They done? Oh, boiled eggs. You can have oh, them. that one's going to take forever. Oh my god, you're just getting that going now? Soft or hard, but Oh my god, the fried eggs are going to be cold. No, I don't think it really matters. Because, like I said, I'm only showing you the basics. <laughs> it's up to you what you want, how An you want. An instructional video on how to make every type of egg. So you know how long you want them. True. True. Right, I've turned the heat off these poached eggs. I'm going to show you how I was taught how to test if a poached egg is you were taught. done or not. Obviously, you take the lid off because it's a waste of time leaving the lid on because you, your knife wouldn't get through it. It'd just be like... So true. So true. It's hard to get to the egg when the lid is on, Kay. Doesn't make much sense to leave it on. How are you going to get to the egg if the lid is on? That's That's Ooh. a pro tip right there, let me tell you. Ooh. Oh, that needs. Ooh, oh, that you lovely. stabbed it. You mm -hmm. stabbed it. Oh my god. It might be best. I'd, I'd leave those in for. Me. I mean, it's hard to tell because it also is just filled with butter. So <laughs> it could Family. just be because all the butter just hanging out in there. In the way. All I've done is just stab the white bit and it, the, t the, table, the table. 
the knife has come out very clean. And I mean, I guess, see, it's, I guess there's a lot of water in there. It's come away from the uh, porch. Okay. Yeah, yeah. That, that's, that's it. I, I think that's, that's done. So I'm just going to give them a second. The ring is switched off, but it's still... So I see it's still, still got some heat. steam in there, yeah. As you can see, the scrambled eggs have just come out of the microwave. Oh. Uh, okay. Oh, it's come out of the microwave. So I'm just going to tip them onto this plate. I guess, uh, it's, yeah, it's not wrong. That's it, nice and clean. Looks a little, a little strange, but, uh... And all I'm going to do is just cut them up. Suppose it worked. Oh, that looks like it's probably Definitely very chewy. Oh, it's all but foamy. All, why is I'm it... Why is it all cloudy? The, uh, the, the <laughs> I don't know if I would have microwaved them. I don't know, I haven't told you. I should have told you. I'm so sorry for not letting you on. I have got some eggs boiling in this pan. As you can see, the water is starting to boil. I see it, I see That's probably it. Probably why I'm making that noise. They're, oh, they're getting a little rumbly rumble. Careful, now it's gonna be at. To... Well, that's steam. You don't want to get a steam burn. Let's take a look at these poached heggies. Let's see them. Oh my god. You can eat the out of it. No, I'm kidding. You can't really eat the out of it. <laughs> the cup, so edible egg up. cup. And now I am gonna let the. Oh, no, I'm not. I am going to change plates over. Oh my god, these, these hard boiled eggs are going to take forever. As you can probably hear, the eggs are bubbling away like, oh my word, it's come on. As you can probably hear, the eggs bubbling away. Oh wow, look at that. Look at that perfectly poached heggy right there. Now my egg is perfect. Little dollop. My eggs are coming out perfect. Watch this. Uh, might, have speak, might have spoke too soon. A little slippery, a little slippery these over there. Break up in the pan. I should have put some salt in them, salt and vinegar in them. To help your eggs from breaking up, you can put salt and vinegar in to stop them from cracking. They are the poached eggs. I don't know if you can see them. My son's giving me the uh, three finger sign, telling me that I've only got three, fin oh, three fingers left. Three minutes, <laughs> three minutes. <laughs> Please cutting you off. Three minutes left on my camcorder. Oh so my gosh, we've got to wrap this up. Don't get the eggs done. I can give you a rough idea of the end product. You can see the eggs are boiling at the moment. And now oh my god, you're wasting time. time. Just wait till they're done. And I'm going to turn them off. Oh no. And I'm going to deshell the eggs. Deshell? The then I'm going to show you the ending part. Oh wow. Oh, are we going to make it in time? <clears throat> M products before the judges say uh, spatula is oh, down. I know they're supposed to be together, but they're not. And there's no taste test because everybody knows what egg tastes it's like. It's so now, true. Like eggs, which is what they are. Really. It's so true. Okay, you know, if there was a taste test, we would just say, just tastes like an egg. Just tastes like an egg, a bit different. Just tastes like a fried egg. <laughs> Just tastes like scrambled eggs. As you know, I've not got a, a, a lot of minutes to tell you this. Um, as you, oh as most God. of you will probably know, and probably most of these viewers, uh, which are probably... You're, you're wasting time, well. Kay. As you will know, I you're am going to time. be on the television. <gasps> I am going to be on I heard a about show this. called Harry Hill's Alien Fun Cap Show. So that what is an why interesting I've been name. down London. And I get, we're going to tell you about the po egg poacher. The hat was a gift. The t-shirt, sort of. The hat <laughs> was a gift. Very nice. Two hats. Very nice hats. <laughs> Two hats. Oh, it sounds like I'm swearing. Two hats were a gift. The t-shirt was a gift, and the egg poacher you saw, saw me using was also a gift. Oh my so, gosh, incredible. Asking for t-shirts and hats, it ain't gonna happen unless someone will want to make the merchandise and we come to an agreement. True, so, true that. She, I mean, she does have the merch now, it's just, you gotta like, 
send her a bank transfer or something okay anyway so we saw we i mean she made those she made those uh, hard boiled eggs no problem let's see if she can go ahead and turn that into an egg salad sandwich and baked beans i have a feeling the uh baked beans part is going to be opening a can and heating it up in the microwave or, or on the stove but uh let's let's check it out uh the from the picture this is gonna be uh not exactly what i would picture as an egg salad but uh Let's see. Hi, people. Let's see. And oh I'm my gosh, the Christmas cake. sweater? Today, I'm going to be a making Christmas sweater? an egg salad sandwich with baked beans. Very low level right now. Well, as you can see, oh, of I'm course, we have to butter the bread. Butter the bread. Of course, of course. Put the other slice on under the other slice. True. Buttering it up very again, the energy is so much lower this time. Different versions of their salad to what maybe your throat's have. bothering her. Very nice, very nice. Buttered. Oh, you can see the eggs are already being. Is, is everything all right, Case? She sounds a little down, right? Uh, see, the eggs have been well, it looks like the there's the yolk might still be a little soft in there. I don't cooked know. Oh, that's fine. Cooked. Right. Okay, and they've been cut. Very nice. Very nice. See, when I think of an egg salad, I think of like just Not cool, very well. mashed up and mixed with mayo, you know? That's what yeah, I yeah, think I'll of for an there. egg salad. Now, a lot of people said they don't like mushrooms on their salad. Well, I think mushroom makes a salad. I don't so, know if I've ever had mushrooms in an egg salad. Maybe I have a different idea of what egg salad is than oh. Kay. I don't know. Maybe it's something else there. I think of uh, I think of just mashed up eggs and mayo. Because I think a mushroom with, with little bits of seasoning. Salad. The only thing I don't like about mushroom, only just, thing I don't like about salad, is all them onions when they put loads and loads of onions on. Oh. I don't know if I've had onions in an egg salad that much. Nice Maybe time a little bit. For a little romaine or the lettuce. Go on. What is that? Some butter lettuce or something. Wow. No mayo at all? Really? Right, as you can see. Also, well like, just big it. hunks of raw mushroom with, like, the woody stems and all. Some oh, that's going on the sandwich. Oh, wow. Beans on it. I don't want it overflowing, so... Just, oh, just, like, just like four or five beans. Got it. A little sauce. <laughs> okay. I know, but it tastes... like, what, like six beans on there? Very nice. Oh, oh everything's <laughs> falling out. When I make a well, sandwich, well, make a yeah, one. it's untoasted buttered bread <laughs> and a bunch of loose stuff on it. Oh, I'm so confused by the mushroom. There's a big, big old slice of mushroom Actually, raw. It's not really that bad. It tastes just quite all right. Really? I know it's That's... another short video, and wow. I am trying to make them longer. <laughs> but if you like what you smoke, sorry, there's going to be a link in. Is everything all right, Kay? To, I'm a little concerned. To my merchandise. If you like what you see, see there you go. There's, there's the merch. If you want to give me a thumbs up, please do. Well, the sandwich is what it is, but I wonder if everything is all right with you. You seem and sound so down out of it. Hope you're doing well. Oh, true. Case Cook said, "No, it isn't. I'm getting better. Thanks." Oh no. Oh, chest infection. Oh yeah. She. I feel like she always gets like a, a chest infection. That's why, she, like, every once in a while, she's like got like the low, the low scratchy voice because I guess she just just gets that a lot. I can honestly say I have never seen an egg salad like this. Neither have I. Neither have I. There, where's the mayo? Am I right? You can have a salad without mayo. <laughs> never thought I'd see eggs, raw mushrooms, baked beans, and lettuce in a sandwich. But first time for everything, I guess. Ooh, someone said, Kay, could you please make homemade turkey Twizzlers and potato smiles? I don't know what either of those things are. But uh, she replied, yes, they are on my list. Must be nice. All right, well, I mean, dang, I hope Kay's feeling better soon. Uh, I really thought this was going to, uh, up and up until the last one, I thought this was going to be like a pretty standard, uh, you know, like it seems like everything came out okay. I, I'm not... <laughs> Really, it really threw me for a loop with that last egg salad sandwich there. But uh, I guess, you know, it, the three out of four, not too bad, not too bad. Anyway, don't forget, I got a whole playlist checking out uh, Kay's cooking videos on uh, my YouTube channel. Make sure you're subscribed so you can always see 
when I'm uploading new stuff. And uh, hey, don't forget, uh, go 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 give uh, go give Case Cooking a follow as well. She makes it all possible there. And check out my new merch down below. Should be some listings there to take you to the website. Follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Willow Davis. I'll be on there playing some games, chatting, hanging. It's a lovely time. And other than that, I'll see you next time. Willow Davis out.